Hello everyone, Adam Jackson here today, and today I'm here playing Balloons Tower Defense 5. Um, you may be wondering, well, what happened? You were playing it, and then you didn't play it anymore. Um, what happened was, uh, Windows 10 got released, actually, and then Fraps, um, couldn't record the desktop anymore, so I could not record for a while because I didn't know how. But then I remembered, oh yeah, OBS can record, and it works with my headset. A lot of other screen recorders haven't or can't work with USB headsets. Um, you know, some com there was one, you know, group that gave me the, the runaround. They told me to do all these things. I even reinstalled my drivers, and that didn't work. So it just doesn't work with this headset for some reason. But um, OBS has the recording functionality, which is what I am doing right now. So I'm going to play a round of Bloom's Tower Defense. Imagine that. Um, let's see here. I want to pick a map. I don't really have... Uh, I don't, I'm debating whether to do a challenge or pick a map. I think I'm just going to pick a, a map. Uh, let's do this one, Pumpkin Patch. We'll do this on medium. That'll be, that'll be interesting. All right. So, this shouldn't be too laggy. Um, I'm not going to use any special agents. I only use those, like, when I want to have fun. Um, alright, so let's see here. What to do? Very limited water on this map. Um, I really love water-based towers, if you didn't know already. Um, you know what, let's just, let's just play some monkeys down. And then we'll place a sub in here. And if you know, and I usually like to place, get as many in uh, as I can. Like in, in, you know, the little area of water. So this level definitely won't be hard. We'll just knock through all these. Uh, let's see here. So things have been going well for me, guys. I got a new office chair, so if you hear that squeaking, I'm not sure if you can hear that. Uh, that is my new office chair. Um, I'm sorry about that. I'll try not to let it squeak too much, but um, it will be nice. Very nice for me. Uh, let's put you over there, set you to strong. All right, this is a good start. This is a very good start. Um, I'm just gonna plan to finish this, uh, this, this round. Um, that's just gonna be my plan for this episode, and see if I can do it in under a half an hour. If not, I might have to speed up, um, the middle of this episode so I can get through the whole thing. Uh, I wanna keep it to about, you know, 25 minutes, half an hour, that kind of thing. It's usually what I like to keep my videos around. Alright, we'll upgrade that guy's range. I just want to get, like, the basics, you know. I'll get a cannon in a few rounds so I can cover up everything, and then I'll have some fun. I kind of want to use a lot of these guys and maybe some tack shooters and stuff. Um, I don't use boomerangs or ninjas a lot, so maybe I'll try working with some of those. I'll try not using, like, the towers I normally go for. Like, normally I just go monkey sub, monkey village, monkey buccaneer, a few normal monkeys, few snipers... And quite a few cannons. But I'm going to try to... Oh, and tack shooters. And a nice tower here and there. But I'm going to try to, like, be a little more... I'm, n I'm not going to try... I'm going to try not to use all of those towers. I'm going to try to use towers I don't use as much. Um, but you guys will see that there are some towers I like to default to. Especially when I do battles, you'll see. I have a pretty consistent lineup. I'm going to get a bomb and then an ice, but I wanted to get this guy upgraded to the triple darts. Um, I might try doing a Super Monkey fan club. We'll see. I always say I want to do those, but then I never do, so, you know, oh well. Let's see. Um, I know a lot of you, there are probably some of my viewers who don't know a lot about this game. Um... It's actually really fun. Tower defense games are really fun for me. I like the strategy they have. Uh, we're already around 10 of 65. These first few rounds go pretty fast. 
But I'm going to see if I can get a, a medal on this one. I'm ranked 67 if anyone wants to know. I have no idea what this RBE means, so if any of you know what that means, um, feel free to comment in the comments and tell me so I know. Because I'd like to know. Uh, let's see. No, I'm going to save up for a bomb. I know it, like, it's not a huge deal, but I, I kind of want to get it down. Then I'll give this guy, you know, camo detection and whatnot. Alrighty here. Uh, bomb tower is 650. Almost there. Yeah, I know. Uh, let's see here. There we go. Alright, so I'll place this guy down right, right here. I'll make this guy my... Like, I usually like to have one bomb tower kind of upgraded uh, down the left path. Just to massively destroy lots of balloons. Because you see, even like this, it's pretty good. But you'll see it gets very good. And I'm going to set him to strong just for the heck of it. Give him a little more range. That's good. I got some yellows in here. Uh, sure, we'll go with frags. Why not? Why not? Uh, maybe we'll... I want to get the... I, I just want to, like, upgrade this guy a little more. You know, money is scarce sometimes. One thing I do find about this game is it can get, like, really loud volume-wise. I don't know. I don't really know why. That's just the way it is sometimes. All right, bigger bombs. All right. So those heart balloons are regen balloons. For any of you who don't know, they regenerate their layers. Reds are the weakest. You know, greens turns into blues, turn into reds. It's all pretty basic, and I mean, just from watching, you can get a basic understanding. Almost there. I just want to get up to 800. Then I'm going to upgrade my monkey sub and my sniper and maybe get some of my more common towers. See how crazy, crazy that is? Alright, so I'm going to upgrade this guy with advanced intel. That allows it to shoot within the range of other towers. Um, monkey subs, they're new, but like they've been around for a while, so, you know. But uh, I, I really, I'm a huge fan of monkey subs. Um, if you couldn't tell. <laughs> uh, I really like, uh, I also like dartling I'm a huge fan of. Spikes are good. Um, I don't use them all that often, but I I do like them. Tack shooters I really like for some reason. Not totally sure why. They're not the strongest of towers. They're just really good at knocking out the smaller balloons. Um, I'm not going to do submergent support right now because I'm not too worried about camos. I am going to get air burst starts. Then come over here and we'll upgrade our sniper. I wish there was like a setting you could have so you could like make a checkbox and it was like just automatically run rounds until you say stop. That would be nice. We're on round 29. Okay. Uh, not that one. This one. Give him night vision so he can see camos. And let's see here, um, I think I'm going to place down a monkey village. So here's, I'm going to explain a little my strategy, and then I'm going to uh, speed this up a bit, so you guys don't have to, you know, I can only talk about so much during the game. So I'm going to get uh, a monkey village, and get a few towers, and make a, a setup, and then I'll be back. Well, I mean, I'm not leaving. I'm just doing a, a, 
a speed up here. So um, I'll be back talking in a little bit. Okay guys, I'm back, and I'm going to buy a super monkey, uh, just to make sure he's within range of my, uh, my other tower here. Um, you might have seen it, um, you might have missed it, you might have not understood what I was doing. I wanted to buy the monkey town upgrade, because it gives you more cash per pop, and I still might do that, but I think I might have placed this in a bad location, I might have placed it in a good location. Um, so, I might still do that, but I figured I might as well get a super monkey. So, I might save up for that now, actually. But first, I'll place a plane, because why not? What happens if I change his path? Nah, I'm going to leave his path like that. nice so see if i had upgraded it those would all be getting me 50 percent more cash but i didn't so they're not um but i think i'm gonna hold up and upgrade it right now it's a i don't really like banana farms i don't think they're worth it like in the later levels i usually play for the later levels but you know whatever i did place a uh, spike factory down there, which I'll upgrade as soon as I get this upgraded. Um, because I wanted to make sure I had, like, some defense at the end, even if it's not a ton. Alright, guys, um, we'll be back in one sec. Sorry for the interruption, guys, I am back. Sounds like we have a Moab. I will get some Moab Maulers in just a second. Keep saying I'm going to do things. I'm kind of smarting from not getting this. I, I wish I had gotten this upgrade. Look at all that cash I could have gotten. Oh well. Just get it ASAP. That guy cleared out those. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. We are going to... Now that we have that, I'm going to upgrade that guy down that path. I'm going to upgrade that guy. I did make a mistake in placing this guy. I placed him. I placed like a a, a ninja and I wanted a, a boomerang. So I just replaced it. Let's get some Moab Mullers. Um, since Moabs can't be camo, I'm just going to place it out here because why not? And it can also get anything that gets by there. Alright, so I need some defense in the back. Alright. Alright, um, I'm gonna place a wizard down. I'm gonna... I'll put him there. Okay. And we'll just upgrade him a bit. And I'll probably get another Moab Mauler. See, any balloons that get popped in here, more cash. Can I not? Oh, okay. 
I usually set my Moab molars to strong so they target the Moabs because they're the strongest balloons. You see, Moab maulers, if you don't know, they wreck havoc, havoc on Moab class balloons, inflicting 10 times damage. So they're actually really, like, really good against Moabs. Like, insanely good. So, usually, you just have a few of those. Or if you're me, you have, like, a billion. No, <laughs> not that many. Uh, but enough. Like, a lot. Enough to pretty much take down any Moab that quickly. Of course, when you get to the late later rounds, it's, like, absolutely insane. Put one more here and then I'll stop with Moab Maulers. I'm gonna upgrade this one a little bit. Okay. Uh, let's see here. I will. Just get this one, and then I'll switch over. Almost done, but I'll probably keep going, because why not? See, these are the rounds where, you know, you really have to get good cash flow so you can get those important upgrades that will help you in the later rounds. Uh, we've got a BFB. Don't remember what that stands for. Knocked out those Moabs like they didn't even exist. Um, instead of upgrading that attack shooter, I'm going to upgrade my Super Monkey. Two laser blasts. And I'll increase his range. Uh, let's see here. I'm also going to get another Monkey Sub. There we go. Okay. Uh, seems good. Alright, and what else can I get? Uh, let's see here. Kind of just handling balloons down there right now. Oh, that was just a lot of camos, so those cannons couldn't detect the camos. Okay, that was a little scary. Not gonna lie, not gonna lie. Let's put a ninja down here. Just upgrade him just a bit. I know this is a little laggy, I'm sorry about that. I'm also gonna stick a cannon down here just to get any leads that come down. We'll just make him a cluster bomb, why not? Why not? Never miss targeting or Operation Dart Storm. I don't want the ability. The ability is the right path, correct? Yeah, so... Abilities are always down the right path. And I don't want the ability on this. Um, some towers, I like the abilities. This one, I don't want it on. I'd, I'd rather just... It's too laggy, <laughs> honestly. So, we got a BFB, we gotta handle that guy. I'm going to put down one of these. Upgrade him a bit. Sorry, this is getting pretty laggy. It, it, it normally does, though. Yay! We completed, and we got the pumpkin patch silver. Nice. So, um... That, that is the end of that round. I'm going to keep playing a little bit. Let's see how far we can go.
Um, I may lose or I may just quit because I might. Um, but yeah, Balloon's Tower Defense is fun. Um, so if you guys want to see more of this, uh, feel just uh, keep giving your support and I'll be doing more of this, um, especially over the summer. Um, hopefully I'll be able to get some of my friends in on it. Uh, I know, uh, SuperScore583, that's my sister Hannah, uh, she does, she plays Bloons Tower Defense, and then Monkey of Darkness also plays Bloons Tower Defense, so hopefully I'll be able to play with them at some point. Um, we did do a recording session, and OBS wasn't hooked up correctly. Um, I had to fix something in order to get this to work, so, yeah. Uh, let's go for ice shards. Sure. I don't really like that ability, but whatever. Whatever. I'm gonna get a mortar, too, because I feel like it. That's why. And we'll set it to be right here. And we'll just do, like, the, you know, the easy upgrades. Because there's no point not to. Okay, those balloons are getting wrecked. Okay, that's quite a lot of camos. Um, Super Monkeys normally can't see camos, but because I have this, they can. I wish they would pop inside the range, but... Oh well. Let's get one of these. Let's just put this guy down there. Okay, we'll give him a few upgrades. Um, these guys... These guys are very good against camos. And once you get late game, they're like really good. Their ability is actually pretty good. So, I usually like to have these, especially if I'm going, like, long game. Um, let's see here. We'll just go, like, a few more levels. Uh, we'll go to up to round 80-ish. That sounds good. Um, maybe I'll upgrade this guy. Or I could upgrade something else. I'm gonna put. I'm gonna see how good attack shooter is at the beginning. I'm gonna test that out. There, I don't get to test things a lot. Like obviously there's free play mode, but uh, I'm assuming most of the Moabs would be done at this point. But let's try it with. Uh, let's try uh, spike ball factory maybe. That sounds good. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? I, f I keep f I, I have a dartling now. I'm going to go spike ball. See how that does. Um, the reason this gets so laggy is because there are so many entities, so... Um, it's probably not crazy enjoyable to watch, but... You know... If you upgrade this guy down so far, it gets a lot better. Also, if you destroy the balloons earlier. Yeah, that's not doing that bad down there. Uh, I'm gonna slap down a super monkey right here. Right here. Just for the heck of it. Oh, I remember that way. This might be the end of us. Oh, this tower with this upgrade is extremely laggy, in case you guys didn't figure that out. Um, FYI. I'm going to set this guy to strong so he pops the Moabs. I'm 
and just track these guys. Um, but I'm thinking I'm coming to a good stopping point for this episode. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of Bloons Tower Defense. Um, next episode, I will be doing a challenge episode. So um, if you guys have an idea for a challenge, like you can only use certain towers or you can only or you have to play like, you know, you can only use certain tower. Yeah, you can only use like certain towers or you have to complete like within a time limit or, you know, you, you can only use a certain amount of sorry about that. Uh, you can only use a certain amount of like these towers, you know, if you have that uh, idea, leave it in the comments. Otherwise, I'll come up with uh, one of my own. Um, and if you want, you can even recommend a map. I might do it. I might not. We'll see. Uh, but I'm going to do one more round here as I do my outro. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of Bloons Tower Defense. Keep playing Bloons. I'm not going to I'm not going to end till this is done. Those are all going to die. Okay. I'm bad at outros, I know. Um, I just want to finish this level. I just want to finish it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just want to finish the level. <laughs> What's this guy's pop count? He has a pop count of 28. That's kind of funny. This guy probably has a pop count of zero. Yep. Okay, that's good. See, the tax users are actually... Or the, uh... Those things are actually pretty good. The, uh... The... These... I hope you have enjoyed this episode. Keep playing Blues Tower Defense. Uh, uh, no, don't die. No, no, Blades. No, no, no. Ha ha. Take that, Bloons. I didn't lose a life. See, I didn't lose a life. Ha ha. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. Keep playing Bloons Tower Defense, and goodbye.